goal of the Refugee Wellbeing Project really is to promote the mental health and well-being and adjustment of refugees who are resettling in the United States. But the reason that it's sort of unique is that we do this by really emphasizing the strengths that refugees bring to, um, to the United States and our emphasis is on promoting mutual learning between college students and refugee families. So there's actually two portions, so it's the class itself, just basically learning about um, policy, how b people become refugees, um, and what kind of conditions they face, you know, before and after coming to the U.S. or wherever they're relocated. And then the second part is actually um, working with new arrival refugee families but then a lot of the focus is on advocacy. So the students work with the refugee families to identify the family's goals. And it's not what the student thinks the family's goals should be, but what the family's goals are. And then they work together to identify resources in the community to help meet those needs and to mobilize those resources. So I think that one of the strengths that UNM students bring is really their experience as Americans, um, their enthusiasm, they're um, young and also by um, creating a program where students get credit for their involvement in the program, they're learning but they also have a lot of time to devote to spend with refugee families and really develop meaningful relationships together and have the opportunity to really learn from each other and mobilize resources together. I, well, I actually felt like we related really well, like we had a lot of the same problems, you know, with, with health care availability, with um, personal issues. Um, I have a sick parent and they were really able to, you know, help me through that. And they also introduced me to this like stronger sense of family. I feel like I'm closer with my own family. And I mean, there's this, I think, um, universal human want to help other people. And so I think that that's like one of the reasons this is most important. And you know, there's a lot of other motivations for helping disadvantaged groups, you know, whether it be economic or political or anything like that. But at the end of the day, it's just another person who you can really, you know, offer something to. And in turn, they can offer something equally as great to you. So I think the students learn as much or more than refugee participants in the program. So they not only gain, I think, a different perspective on the United States and some of the privileges that we may take for granted, um, they also learn about the need for different changes, though, also um, in terms of how people access resources and how things are structured here, but doing it in a way where you're also making a big difference in the lives of families who are coming here to resettle.